If you ever had doubts about Solana in the past, you must know that you were wrong. But if you have never heard of the name, this video is for you. As you may know, out of thousands of cryptocurrencies that are on the market today, only a few manage to stay afloat and they have good reasons to be around. So before we begin today's video on Solana, I want you guys to hit that subscribe button and turn the notifications on. It's only a second for you, but your support means a lot to us. And keep in mind guys, this is not financial or professional advice. Anything I say or show in these videos is based on my own research, experience, and understanding. If you need to take action, please consult with a practicing professional first. That said, let's start the video. Solana is a project dedicated to solving the blockchain trilemma. It wants to build a scalable network, which is much faster than any existing blockchain, and even Visa. As of mid-2021, Solana supports 50,000 transactions per second, TPS, and produces new blocks every 400 milliseconds with the help of 200 validating nodes, all while maintaining close to zero network fees. Solana uses eight innovative technologies to achieve its goals. But in this guide, we will touch on the two major ones, Proof of History and Turbine. Solana has always provided a solution for a major problem in the blockchain, consensus. It is a process of agreement between blockchain nodes on the new transactions. For consensus, ordering of events is important. For example, you should not be able to spend funds before you receive them. To address this problem, most blockchains incorporate reliable global time for the network and use timestamps for every occurring event to understand its position relative to all the other events. For instance, Google's distributed database called Spanner uses three atomic clocks that are synchronized to a very high precision level which provides a reliable source of time. But timestamps cannot be trusted 100% in decentralized networks. In fact, proof of work can be regarded as a mechanism for demonstrating passage of time between events. By using it, Ethereum and Bitcoin become slow and often incur costly transactions. Solana addresses this problem with verifiable delay functions and a novel mechanism called proof of history. And to understand that one, we need to know about the hash functions. Hash functions allow you to scramble information in a very random manner. A hash function always returns strings of the same length, no matter the input size and type. What really matters is that these functions are very sensitive to changes in input. For example, feeding coin rivet and coin rivet gives completely different results, even though we simply omitted the space. Now, proof of history is a mechanism which helps order the events on blockchain. Instead of creating a unified time for all participants, it allows every node to check the validity of order independently. First, a hash function is applied to a random string. Its output is hashed again, and so on. This creates a sequence of hashes. When a new event occurs, it can be appended to this chain starting at some point, causing all future hashes to change. Because of sensitivity to input changes, the new values have been computed from scratch, and they are published for verification. Since computing hashes requires time, Publishing correct hashes proves that real time is passed after a new added event. Checking a given sequence of hashes, on the other hand, is computationally easy. Modern GPUs have around 4,000 cores and the job of verifying the sequence can be parallelized. And the job verifying sequence can be parallelized. For a 4,000 long chain of hashes, core one checks hashes one and two, core two checks hashes two and three, and so on all at the same time. If anything does not match, a malicious attempt is identified straight away. This makes quick ordering and block formation possible. Solana's main net has been live for several months now. In 2020, Serum Decentralized Exchange was launched by the Solana team. It is built on top of Solana Network, which allows it to inherit the speed and reliability of the main blockchain. Other DeFi projects like Radium and Bonfita are adding to Solana's development with more projects like O3Swap and Soulstarter on the way. With more than 7,000 nodes and 90,000 validators, 
Ethereum remains a more powerful network than Solana. But recently, more and more projects have started showing faith in Solana. Ken Ecosystem, with more than 30 million accounts, has switched to Solana in 2020. This year, over $100 million was invested into Solana to facilitate its expansion to the Chinese market. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you in the next one.